ピクを飢饉が襲うのは何年か後こうして食べるものも普通にあるのに革命が起きそうになっているというのは引っかかりますわねやっぱり難しいことを考えるときは甘いものがないとダメですわねミーヤは早々に考えるのをやめた All right, episode nine of Tear Moon Empire. And here's what I will say, my friends. Very interesting episode of Tear Moon Empire. Not a very entertaining episode for me, just personally, personal experience on this episode. I thought it was a good episode. I thought it was an interesting episode. And I thought that there was, you know, enough moving parts here to keep and maintain interest. I just wasn't thoroughly entertained this episode. I was a little bit bored. But because I was bored doesn't necessarily mean that it's, it'll be boring to someone else. And again, I want to preface that it was a very interesting episode. And again, because of all those moving parts, this is just a personal thing to me. Like, I felt a little bored this episode. The major events that happened revolution going on in Abel's country, which we knew it was going to happen, that those dudes were going to instill some kind of revolution. Okay. So we saw it coming, we knew it was going to happen. That revolution gets gets kind of、uh, posed into Mia and, like, hey, like, what are you going to do about this kind of thing? Mia begins breaking down because the reality is、uh, she's probably in love with Abel, okay? Like, when she imagines the perfect dude, she thinks of Abel. No problem there. It makes perfect sense. She's gotten really close to him. She's also still trying to avoid the death, you know, the death flag for her. But at the end of the day, it's like, hey, this dude matters this much. I can't. I can't not have action. I need to take action. So that's you know, that's what happened there. She gets the merry band together and gets everybody you know, together here. And she gets support from you know, from Sion and the priestess girl, and the other girl is going to kill her. She gets enough backing.、Uh, the girl who she reads with with the glasses, she's like, okay, I'll help you get across because we have some trade routes going on with, with the country that's getting, you know, the revolution's happening. So they find a way to get over there. So they put a plan together. They instill like their plan to go over to that country, meet up with Abel, try and see if they, what they can help and figure out over there. No problem there. They get on a carriage, a couple of funny scenes with her about to throw up.、Uh, you know, the, again, really funny stuff there. She falls off because, of course, she does when the, when the wagon gets hit by a group of, we'll call them so called bandits. The bandits, they seem like assassins, to be honest.、Uh, and I'm sure there's going to be more information that comes from there. And I'm sure the old dude who ended up saving her later might even be part of said bandit group.、Uh, at least that's kind of what my inner feeling is telling me. But they get hit by bandits. She,、uh, Sion goes and saves her. She ends up with Sion. They find a village. They talk about revolution. Now we're going to see what happens next. So, really, those are the, the major chain of events, you know, kind of really squeezed down into like, you know, what, 30 seconds for me e x p l a i n it. But very interesting to see what's going to happen. But again, I can't not say like I was like completely entertained because I wasn't. I was a little bit bored by it. I did pause one, two, three times. You know, I paused probably in the 12 minute mark right before they actually are, or right, no, right when they went onto the carriage.、Uh, I paused. I went, I got some food, came back. Uh, finished up the last few, you know, few minutes or whatever. When they got to the old dude's house to eat the rabbit soup, I paused again,、uh, scrolled Twitter for a couple of seconds. I came back and I finished it.、Uh, when episodes kind of cause me to go, like, I just need to hit the pause on this because I'm, I'm just like, my eyes are just like, you know, I'm about to just,、uh, like, I'm about to start thinking, what am I gonna do tonight? Am I gonna play a video, a video game? Like, what am I gonna do? When I start, like, you know, not really, like, I'm looking, I'm like, I'm looking, I'm reading, but I'm not paying attention. That's when I'm like, okay, let me pause, let me come back. And that's when I know that the episode's boring me.、Uh, unfortunately, I would say probably the worst episode of Tear Moon Empire so far, but that doesn't mess, again, that doesn't equate to it being a bad episode. Just me personally, I would say this is the worst episode so far. That I was at least entertained for. Again, not, the, not a bad episode, just for me, not the best episode. And I would say if I were to rank episodes one through nine, this would definitely be at the number nine spot so far.、Uh, but next episode, shit's probably about to go down, and that's what I appreciate.、Um, quick, easy, in and out, probably like the day you were made. <laughs> that's a joke. I'm just kidding. It probably took a lot longer. A lot of love. A lot of love making. Probably four hours, not four minutes. But,、uh, anyways, just quick. Easy and out, just like prom night. So let me know what you guys thought in the comments down below. I'll see you guys next week for Tier Moon Empire number 10. Appreciate you guys being here as always, and、uh, much love, guys. See you guys next weekend. Happy December.